Welcome to day six of my vis a -vis rack experiments. I'm Ablaud and today I have a pink noise based patch. The only sound source for this patch is pink noise. Now what is pink noise? It is similar to white noise, except that pink noise has the same amount of noise energy per octave. And because the frequency spectrum is logarithmic, if you have white noise, the higher octaves get more energy because it's equal energy per frequency. So pink noise is not, it doesn't sound as high, you could say. Anyway, um, so today I've been experimenting with pink noise, but I'm nowhere near a full patch. But I just wanted to report about what I've come up with today so far. Um, doing this, I did come across a lack of certain tools, especially a flanger. So if there is any dev um, of vSphere Act modules that would be interested in doing one, well, a flanger would be welcome. Anyway, let's uh, listen to what we have here. So far, you only hear the noise as it goes through these um, South Pole Parasite modules, Spectral Madness and uh, Oliverb, the reverb. So these are alternative incarnations of the clouds module. And these go straight into my mixer, and it gives a kind of a vaguely waterfall sounding noise. Okay, what else do we have? We have the clock, which is set to very slow. 60 BPM divided by 5 and divided by 6. So we have 10 seconds here and 12 seconds there. Uh, this clock triggers this micrograph, microtopograph module, which is a, a rhythmic trigger module. And I use this to trigger Caudal, Rampage, and both sides of this rampage. So these envelopes and here uh, triggers for modulation of all the rest that I have here. So here we have our pink noise. As you can see, it goes into two tangents filters, two unstabile filters, and also here into a Damien Lillard which has frequency bands, but these are heavily modulated by Caudal, with an effect that you get some kind of formants uh, changing there. Let's listen to that. So this goes into this mixer, but of course you don't get anything because we haven't triggered this yet. So let's start our clock. Okay, we have two other voices. There they are. Okay, so this is the noise from the Damien Lillard filter. And uh, all together, as you hear the different voices are very slowly triggered and we get some kind of wind noise coming out of these filters. Uh, the cutoff and resonance are modulated by Caudal, which is triggered by micrograph. Um, I'm having two voice, uh, two channels of Damien Lillard. Uh, one goes through a delay with a very short timing so that we can get some kind of stereo effect. And all of that is also 
uh, send to this reverb, another all reverb. Uh, clouds module function is a reverb, and this chorus. And as a result, we get this windy soundscape. Apart from rampage, which uh, triggers some envelopes, we also have this ballistic envelope generator, which triggers the envelope of the tangent filters. And then there's the seriously slow LFO, set to two minutes, which modulates the, uh, the traveling through the map of topograph. So that the, uh, the triggers change timing. And that is what I have so far today. There's a lot more I'd like to do to this patch, but I'm running out of time and I have to work tomorrow. So that's my experiment for today. Hope you check back tomorrow.